All right, today we're going to be showing you a video of how to turn your tail lights from this to this. The items you're going to need are towels. I got microfiber towels, all purpose cleaner. I got a degree, so you could also use Goo Gone. Tint, I have it pre cut tint. Um, soapy water, put, you can put a little baby shampoo in with some water. Towels, a squeegee, and a hair dryer or a heat gun. It's optional to take your head tail lights out if you want to and it's going to be a much easier to drop so I'm going to start off by removing my tail lights. I've got four screws in the back holding it in place. All right after removing the bolts just pull off the headlight the tail light. Move the bulbs carefully. Take a picture if it helps to know which bulb goes where. Right? Get ready to clean. After you remove your tail light, start spraying it down with your cleaner. And clean the entire tail light, making sure there's no dirt or dust on the tail light. Because that will show in your tint and will bubble up. It will be pretty difficult to remove. After you remove everything, get out your pre-cut tint. It would be easier if you could have a friend hold the tent for you. Using the soapy water, spray down the tent from the outside. Also, your tail light. Move the film off the paper. Spray the entire back adhesive side, which is going to be laying onto the light. Line it up. Now you're ready to start to squeegee. Grab your squeegee, paper towel. Cover the squeegee up to prevent scratches on the film. Start out from the center, move from side to side to move air bubbles and get the soap out from the bottom. You might have to readjust it a few times to get it perfect. Have your heat gun on the highest temperature available. You don't want to get the spot too, um, too hot because you can burn right through the film. But work through it so turn the hair on. Okay, let's get this, this hair bubble out. Go through the whole chair light. Try to get as much of the bubbles out. What this does, it heats up the film and makes it to the shape of the headlight. bubbles disappear. Now when you're done, if you have any film coming out off the side, you want to cut it with the um, razor. Be careful not to cut through the headlight because plastic scratches very easily.
Okay. Take the piece right off. Now we're on to the next one. Now since we're done with this one, my tail light actually comes in three pieces. So I'll repeat the same steps I did with this one to the other two. Then I'll put it on the car and show you the final product. Product. We just finished tinting the tail lights and hopefully we can get a lot more mods up and how to videos for your car. By the way, if anybody wanted to know, this is a 2000 Mustang and we're going to have a lot of Mustang videos as well as other car videos. So if you'd like to see more car videos, just subscribe to my channel. Thanks.